This security camera video shows a man with a backpack calmly dropping what appear to be folded pieces of paper onto doorsteps in the Calorama neighborhood of Northwest D.C. around 7 a.m. We blurred his face because he is not charged with a crime. What he's distributing looks similar to this folded piece of paper that could be seen still sitting on one doorstep 12 hours later. They are crudely made flyers filled with anti-Jewish conspiracy theories, hurtful and intimidating, says Greg Bush, who is Jewish. It was pretty horrifying. It concerns me more than ever. It's something that keeps coming up all the time in media and news articles. D.C. police say anyone who receives one of the flyers should contact them and report it so it can be logged as a hate bias incident and reviewed for prosecution. Anti-Semitic flyers were recently distributed in Rehoboth Beach, Delaware, and have also been found in several D.C. area neighborhoods in recent years. Why create more hate than, that's already out there? And that's what that does. The flyers and the way they're distributed are very similar to the ones neighbors say they found on their doorsteps around this time last year. In Northwest, Jackie Benson, News 4. The Anti-Defamation League says that 63 percent of hate crimes in the U.S. involving religion are fueled by anti-Semitism, a startling number when you consider that only 2.4 percent of Americans are Jewish.